Unilever has been here for, for over 50 years, both the tea operation and the dressings operation. We're transitioning to a new business, um, so we're putting our stamp on the community for hopefully at least another 50 years. It's, it's a very experienced workforce. It's a very caring workforce. They take a lot of pride in what they do. Uh, the, the workforce here in Independence in this plant has been um, very reliable, very um, hardworking. Uh, the community is very supportive. We have wonderful business around here. Uh, the productivity at the Independence facility is excellent. Um, it's one of the reasons why um, Unilever has selected this plant um, to bring a new business opportunity here. It's called the NOR, um, which is your dry savories, your soups, sauces, and gravies. What we're bringing in is we're adding an addition to the east side of the building. We're adding about 100,000 square feet on three separate levels that we're building up. The building phase we anticipate being done sometime, you know, July timetable, August timetable. Then once the building's all done, then we'll start working on bringing equipment in. There's a significant amount of changes. It's going to be all brand new equipment, state-of-the-art packaging uh, equipment, a lot of automation involved. There's going to be a huge line of complexity as it comes with these machines as they're installed here. So the big challenge we have here is we're taking one technology that we're getting ready to shift out of going into a brand new technology. So it's a lot of brand new equipment, new equipment for our employees. So that's really the challenge we have. In addition to the training piece of it, we're going to be bringing on about 90 brand new folks to our operation that currently aren't in Unilever or with Unilever today. So this is just another reflection of how important the uh, Unilever facility is to Independence and how important Independence is to the Unilever facility.